Hey Royals! So, um, I'm gonna tell you something that you might think is weird on many levels, but just go with it. I have production meetings with myself. These production meetings result in a lot of things, like you're gonna start seeing a new outro in the videos after today, because I decided maybe I want an outro. I want to see what that's like. So, I made one. When I got this new microphone, that's, that was a result of meetings with myself, believe it or not. I got a controller <laughs> for playing games based on production meetings I have for myself. So I, the changes that do happen in this channel are decisions that I artistically make with myself. <laughs> so I wrote down the stuff I want to share with you from the production meeting I recently had myself, the one that resulted in the outro I just talked about. But um, as you know, in my last video, I kind of jokingly said some things about the YouTube um, best tips for um, creating community. Like I thought it really bled into this whole clone culture thing. And it's not that I'm against building a community. I absolutely have always wanted to have a community with you guys. It's just that I don't know if YouTube's best tips are necessarily the best way. But in this production meeting, I decided that I genuinely want to build community while avoiding clone culture. And on that note, communities do have inside jokes and stuff. So I decided the psychonomics and royal stuff, that's going to be real. I said it as a joke, but hey, now it's an inside joke. That's something we have. So you are my royals. Give yourself titles. I would love to hear what you have officially named yourself. I am, of course, Queen Amanda the First of the Psychonomics community. Um, I definitely want much more input on, from you guys about anything. Like, are there topics you want me to talk about? Are there games you think I should check out? That kind of thing. But the thing I'm most excited about, and I definitely want input from you guys on, is a series that I'm hoping to launch called Road to One Million. One Million's cut off for subscribers, and I'll, I'll explain this. Um, so, in avoiding clone culture, that means that we should all do our part in promoting the YouTubers who are very creative and deserve lots of love. And so I decided that I want to feature YouTubers that have less than a million subscribers because I feel like the road to the first million is maybe the hardest. Unless you're Jack's films and it seems to be every subsequent million. I love him. I just, I can't stop joking for even a second. I'll die. I'm a shark. Anyway. <laughs> I know I'm awkward. Sorry. <laughs> but anyway, Road to a Million. Right now, I only have a list of six YouTubers I'm definitely, definitely going to do videos on. One might end up being disqualified before I get to him because he has over 900,000 subscribers already. But basically, I want personalities and fun videos and it's okay if they do things similar to someone else because it's statistically impossible to be creative a hundred percent of the time um i've mentioned it before i went to film school and my favorite thing to study was postmodernism and deconstructionism and pastiche and parody and all of that depends on taking what came before and twisting it and making it your own and I think I I'll get to it in a second so all I want is creative youtubers that are fun to watch and deserve a lot of love and have less than a million subscribers and right now on the list like I said one has over 900,000 subscribers but one has 36 so as long as it's under a million size doesn't matter now this thing that I was thinking that I stopped myself on right now is that I want to show you what I mean about what came before and a 
transforming it into something that's your own. My first YouTube video. I've talked about it a million times. I don't like showing it, one, because my cousin was also in it and she doesn't really necessarily like being on camera. But then the other reason is I, it's restricted and I don't want to unrestrict it because I'll lose the original date on the video. And I don't know, I'm a little sentimental about that date. It's my first video. Also, I wasn't the one who restricted it. That was a YouTube glitch because it was a reply to the video that like I was turn into my own thing and then YouTube got rid of the video replies and it, it put all those videos in restricted mode. So, but that was um, in 2008, so we're talking really long time ago. It was somebody made the Power Rangers theme song in Mario Paint and I danced to it. <laughs> but um, maybe one day I'll show a clip, or maybe, you know, not, no, not in this video, but yeah, one day maybe I'll show clips, or I'll put the link in a description, because like I said, I'm not trying to keep you guys from seeing the video, I just, I don't want to lose the date, and I'm trying to kind of respect the privacy of the cousin who was in it, but she knew I posted it on YouTube, so, um. okay, so I think that's all I wanted to cover in this video, um, I'm going to be talking about other stuff fairly soon but yeah I really want to get started on road to a million so if you have nominations for that leave them in my comments I will check out everybody like literally I watch a lot of YouTube YouTube doesn't even know what to suggest to me anymore so I'll literally watch anything and if I think it's the kind of thing that I super want to promote I'll add it to the spreadsheet you can nominate yourselves if you want it's all good but I'm just saying, there's a good chance some of you are already on my list, but whatever. Okay, so that's it for this one, Royals. Remember to practice your psychonomics, and I will see you next time. Bye.